As realtors, we pledge to subscribe to a code of ethics which the National Association of Realtors created over 100 years ago. Considered a living document, it is annually reviewed and updated to keep it relevant to today's market. The essence of the code of ethics is similar to the golden rule. Do unto others as you would have others do unto you. Building trust with clients and customers is simple. It's the little things that make a big difference like respect for the public, your peers, and for property. The Code of Ethics is broken into three parts. Articles 1 through 9 outline the duties to clients and customers. Articles 10 through 14 outline the duties to the public. And Articles 15 through 17 outline the duties to the realtors. There are three important ideas behind good professional behavior in use today. Customs, consideration, and common sense. Customs are the habits of doing certain things like shaking hands and making eye contact. Consideration is simply thinking about the way the other person feels. Returning phone calls or letting your appointment know when you're running late are good ways to show respect. Common sense is an element in nearly all good manners and is as simple as telling the truth and treating others fairly. For example, as realtors, if we are at a house and we see a problem, we need to alert the listing agent. If the sellers request that we remove our shoes upon entering their home, we need to honor that request. Florence Stern said, respect for ourselves guides our morals while respect for others guides our manners. Someone who does the right thing when no one is looking is someone who will do the right thing all the time. Remember, being courteous of others is simple and will go a long way to showing clients and other realtors your value as a professional.